Are you too close? Yo, you're no, reco I'm recording right now. <clears throat> okay. We're, we're uh, at the uh, <clears throat> Excalibur Hotel. This is July 6, 2009. Uh, continuation of our uh, wild and wonderful uh, vacation. It's been absolutely fabulous. Uh, I'm going to try to summarize what all we did uh, yesterday, which was uh, Monday. Uh, Monday we woke up uh, at the Travel Lodge and uh, uh, what what we do first when we uh, oh we had the Hoover Dam tour scheduled and we got up and we had a little trouble finding our pickup pot spot because it wasn't uh, at the hotel we were staying in we had to go around uh, through Planet Hollywood and get in a place and uh, uh, Make sure you watch your finger it don't get on the lens. It's not on the lens. I can see my finger. Okay, cool. And uh, uh, we got got on the Hoover Dam trip. Uh, uh, we had to get, get get on a bus, go to another place, check in, then get in the bus, drive to Hoover Dam. We got out, and it was kind of like a free-for-all. The, the bus driver didn't stay with us and tore us through the dam. Other people did. We had this really funny guy. Uh, with a cane who uh, took us uh, around in some places in Hoover Dam, including the generator place uh, and the diver one of the diversion tunnels. And then he took us upstairs and kind of gave us uh, all free for all there, but the only thing that was left was observation deck and uh, a, uh, like a, not really a museum, but yeah, partly a museum. We looked around in that. Uh, we got on our bus. Well, we came back. Uh, uh, we got to a vehicle that was still at Travel Lodge, and then Troy wanted to go to what Caesar's Palace. Yeah. Or, or we tried to eat first. I, I don't remember. No, we went to Caesar's Palace. We ate here. Okay. We. Uh, I drove, but uh, Lee told me the wrong turn. Not yeah. me and Troy told you the wrong thing. Okay, blame it on both of you. And so we ended up getting back off the strip onto the interstate and had to go a long ways. And when we finally got back on the street, uh, strip, we, it took us a long time to get back to Caesar's Palace. I say a long time, it wasn't like no hour, but you know, 10, 15 minutes or something. And we parked out there while he ran in. He wanted to throw some, some money on Black because his uh, son-to-be wanted uh, some money thrown on Black. He, he Instead of putting 20, he put 40. And he doubled his money and made 80. And uh, then, then we wanted to uh, drive to the Excalibur, uh, check in. We drove over here. This Excalibur is absolutely beautiful outside. It, it looks like a castle. I mean, a real castle. Maybe I'll get some pictures of that in a little while. Still pictures of it. I already got some of it. And uh, we came in here. Troy wanted to go right on to the blackjack tables. Uh, Lee and I went went on to uh, uh, the room. What did we do? Uh, uh, we, oh, we had to go check in. Yeah, we had to stand in a long line check in. Long line check in. We got our clothes and stuff in there. Called Troy up. Uh, Lee wanted to go to the pool. Uh, me and him kind of got a little lost it between each other for a little bit. So I found me a place to eat inside the hotel. I called Troy. He come over and eat with us. It was like a, a Mexican food place. Uh, kind of like Taco Bell or something. And... Uh, uh, Lee caught back up with us, he ate, we, we ate, and then we decided we'd stay out of the heat and not go to the pool today because the pool was outside. So we came, uh, we went back to the room, watched TV. Uh, Lee talked to his girlfriend a lot on the phone. Uh, we kind of got our clothes out. I hand washed our clothes since there's no uh, place to wash our clothes uh, here. And I left them hanging. Uh, we kind of made a little boo-boo here. We thought that our next tour, which I'm not going to tell y'all yet what the tour is until I'm on the tour uh, on the video, uh, but uh, we thought it was at 5.40 this morning that we had to be sitting out here in the rotunda. This is a rotunda area where, where you get picked up for your tours and stuff. And uh, 
we came out here and found out that that wasn't the right tour we were supposed to be on. So we called and found out the tour that we're supposed to be on leaves at 1010. So we went back to a motel and uh, I mean, went back to our room. We've been in the whole hotel the whole time. Uh, went back to our room, was successful at going back to sleep. I got up this morning and I, uh, uh, well, when I first got up originally, I took, a, I have to take three medicines every morning, metformin, tricor, and uh, uh, Crestor. And I had all my pill balls laying out and I was kind of, kind of, I wouldn't say grippy, but I was trying to motivate Lee and he, he was kind of not too happy I was motivating him. So I think I actually took a Xanax this morning, which is not good, because that would like make me really, really sleepy. So, and I thought I was gonna go on my tour half asleep, but, uh, or fully asleep, but it worked out okay, because when I went back to the room, I was able to go right back to sleep, and I've slept some more, and it's uh, about, what, about 10 o'clock this morning? It's uh, 9.52 right now. And remember, we're on Las Vegas time, which is two hours later than Texas time. Earlier. It's two hours earlier. Earlier? No, it's later. Mm-mm. It's, it's 11.55 oh, well, oh, okay. at home. Yeah, 11.55 is at home. And so we're sitting right here waiting on our shuttle bus to come to take us to our next deal. So it's going to be really exciting. So... And by the way, while we, we ate at McDonald's this morning, just before we came out here, and there was a guy. Uh, well, how old would you say that guy looked like? Mm -hmm. Would you say he was 50 or 45? No. Huh? Not even that old, I don't think. I think, no, yeah, man. yeah. He said he was 49. Oh, yeah, that's right. He told us uh, his age, and he seen my Venice Beach shirt, and he asked us, have we been to Venice Beach? And I kind of gave him a summation of all the things we've done. He was with a 15-year-old boy. Uh, I know he's 15 because I asked him how old he was. He's wearing a Dodgers cap. And I asked him, are you a big Dodger fan? He said yes. And I think he said he's seen a game while he was out there in L.A. I didn't know, is it baseball season? I don't keep up with sports. It's the least thing in my mind is sports. And, uh, uh, and I asked him how old he was, 15, and I told him this was... Uh, Lee's first really, really, really big vacation. He may never have a vacation in his life like he's had this round. Uh, I've never had one in my life like this. And this has been absolutely fabulous. So we kind of talked a little bit. They said they was from Gary, Indiana, I believe. And I told him I'd been to Indiana before, to Terry Hall, Indiana. And... Uh, Hopefully this might be our thing coming. Does that look like the I don't other know, one that showed up? But I'm going to go ahead and cut the camera off. Okay. All right. We'll, we'll be talking to y'all with more adventure in a little bit. See y'all guys later.